So now that you're done clearing out this room, just continue on through the door they blew open for you. Make sure you pick up all the ammo because later in the game, I ran out of ammo almost towards the last boss. So didn't not completely, but I was pretty close to running out of ammo to the point where I had to resort to an automatic shotgun for the last boss. So shoot these two guys as they slide down their ropes, and then the one guy who pops over the counter. The enemies in this game, where you see them will most likely be, where. Well, where you see them in the video is where they'll most likely be in your game if you're just doing a simple playthrough. I don't know if they change on difficulties. I beat the first time I beat this game was on the hard difficulty, and this guide is on the hard difficulty. So I have no experience to the easy or medium difficulties. And for a game where it's just hard difficulty with no unlockable difficulties, it was surprisingly easy compared to the first few ga fear games where the extreme difficulty which three or four difficulties was insanely hard you died in a few shots and it took a lot to kill an enemy So, once you get here, aim directly up at that roof and try to shoot this guy before he sees you. If he sees you, it's no big deal, but he's less of a nuisance. Jump on here, and once you get towards the end, just like mash the jump button, whether it's my space bar or whatever you have it to, A button on your Xbox controller, X button on your PS3 controller, wherever you mapped it to on your keyboard. And just jump in this little pool here. For real, it reminded me of a quick little Bioshock cutscene. The beginning of it with all the bubbles. It reminded me of Bioshock. So, well, you just gotta clear out this room. There's one or two guys at the bottom. There's gonna be one guy on the balcony. There's gonna be a guy who runs behind the bar over here. And once you clear these guys out, um, you head up the stairs. Come on. You aim at that door right away, and the guy busts through it every time. And that's the last enemy you fight in this level, pretty much. You get in here, and you gotta find the hidden door. Watching this, you must want to know where it is, so go up to here and close the music box, or interact with it. She's too dangerous. You were telling me to seal my daughter away. You knew it would come to this. We both knew. Once you close that and watch that cutscene, I'm gonna try not to talk through those cutscenes. That door opens up, and here's Genevieve. There are a lot of intel items in this game, but apparently it carries over through save games, so you're not gonna see me pick any of them up. I pretty much have all of them already. So, it doesn't really, I don't know if it gets you any achievements on the Xbox version, but. They're not too hard to find if you look around enough. Here you start wigging out again. Getting on the shrooms. And once your gun raises up again, just go ahead and head out of the room and follow Alma around. Little Alma. Shoot out if you want, it does nothing. I just got bored. And just follow her down the stairs and take a right, and you're all set.
get them aboard. We don't have much time. 